Good evening, everyone. Good evening, teacher. How are you, ladies and gentlemen? Everything nice? Yes, right. They make a little bit this a little smaller to fit in the screen. Okay. Good evening, uh, Juan Carlos, Carolina, Luis Alberto, Maria Elena. Good evening. Good evening, Monica. Okay. Welcome on board. Ese es el Programa Nacional de Inglés para el Trabajo. Modadil, mola, mo, I can't say it. No lo puedo decir. Mo, no. Online. Online. <ríe> Modal, mo, modal, modalidad. Modalidad online. Okay. Beginner. Beginner one. Welcome to your English class. Today is Thursday, July the 15th. This is class 15. And today we have vocabulary practice. Vocabulary practice. Carolina has new headphones. Okay. Nice. New headphones. They, they are nice, Carolina. Very nice. Okay. So this is the general objective. General objective. This is the specific object. And this is the class object. Participants will be able to practice vocabulary. Okay. Los participantes serán capaces de practicar vocabulario. Okay. No comment. Okay. Say so just like that. Now. In the agenda, we have review, prepositions of time, prepositions of time again, practice, and make questions. Okay. The purpose is to ask about times and activities in the review. So before Let's see the attendance. Okay. Friday, Friday the 15th, Alex Enoch Ramirez. No, not yet. Carolina Stephanie Hernandez. Present teacher. Excellent, nice. Edgardo Ernesto Gonzalez. Edwin Ernesto Fabian. Jacobo de Jesus Gomez. I okay. Jacobo. Okay. Jacobo sounded different. But okay. That was Jacobo. No, Jacobo is not here yet. But Juan Carlos yeah. Morales. Present teacher. Excellent. Nice. Karen Elizabeth Ramos. Presente. Excellent. Laura Guadalupe Fuentes. Laura, no Laura. Luis Alberto Olano. Present. Excellent. Nice. Welcome on board. Maria Elena Linares. Present. Excellent. Nice. Maritza Lisette Morales. Present. Excellent. Nice. Monica Maricela Martinez. Present. 
Excellent, nice. Senia Judith Peña Diaz. No Senia, okay. Susana Francisca Amaya. Susan. No, no Susan, okay. Wilber Fernando Aquino. Presente. Excellent, welcome back, welcome on board. Okay, William Alexander Ramirez. No, Yanira Patricia Diaz. No Yanira today, okay. Emerson Eli Moreira. Presente, chef. Excellent, my friend, welcome on board. Kelly Elizabeth Padilla. Missing in action, Kelly, okay. Tatiana Vanessa Escobar. No Tatiana, okay. Well, it seems like today we are only three, six, nine people. Okay, just nine people. Wow, very few. Okay, warm up, preview, purpose to ask about times and activities. This is uh, the review of the affirmative sentences. Okay. Una oración tiene un sujeto, un verbo y un complemento. Right. We study the lesson every day. This is affirmative. We study the lesson every day. He works in his office very hard. She lives very far from here. She lives very far from here. In negative, el auxiliar para el presente es do. Se usa con todos los verbos, excepto con auxiliares modales o con el verbo to be. Right? So you say subject, don't, or doesn't, verb, and complement. In negative, we don't need to be rude. We don't need to be rude. She doesn't work in a store. She doesn't work in a store. Okay, negative. I don't have time. I don't have money. Negative. Auxiliary, subject, verb, and complement. Do you need help with that? Do you need help with that? Question. Does he work for a large company? Does she study the lesson? Does she study the lesson? Does he need help? Do we work very hard? Okay. Affirmative. We study the lesson every day. Negative. We don't study the lesson every day. Question. Do we study the lesson every day? Okay. So affirmative, negative, and question. Examples. Do you study the lesson every day? Yes, I do. Answers. Yes, comma, I do, period. El I, el, el primer sujeto, siempre va en mayúscula. I, yes, I do. Mayúscula, yes, comma, I do, period. Okay. Do you understand math? No, comma, I don't understand math, right? No, I don't. No, I don't. Okay. Do you understand math? No, I don't. Do you study the lesson every day? Yes, I do. Does your father live in this neighborhood? Yes, he does. Father, he. Yes, he does. Does your sister speak English? Sister, she. Yes, she does. Do we have to stay until late today? Tenemos que quedarnos hasta muy tarde hoy? Yes, you do. Sí, tienen que. Tenemos que quedarnos. Sí, se tienen que quedar. Yes, you do. Yes, you do. Do they need to find a new job? Necesitan encontrar un nuevo trabajo? Un trabajo nuevo? No, they don't. No, they don't. Does he watch cartoons? Cartoons, caricaturas, right? Does he watch cartoons? No, he doesn't. No, he doesn't. Does she read a lot of books? 
Does she read a lot of books? No, she doesn't. Does she work very hard? Does she work very hard? Yes, she does. Yes, she does. Do you have time to study the lesson? Yes, we do. Yes, we do. Does it rain in this region? Llueve en esta región? Does it rain in this region? Yes, it does. Yes, it does. Does it snow here in this time of year? No, it doesn't. It doesn't snow. Does it work well? Funciona bien? Does it work well? Yes, it does. Yes, it does. Okay, I would like some volunteers. We're going to divide this into, okay, half. I think that we have three, six, nine, 12, 13. So half would be seven and six, three, six, seven. So here it's going to be half. Oh, no, that's not straight at all. Sorry. Okay, let's, let's do it with another two, three, six, seven. Let's have a different color. Okie dokie. This is A. This is B. Volunteers for A. Who wants to do A? Monica? Thanks. Do you study the lesson every day? Yes, I do. Do you do you understand math? No, I don't. Does your father live in the in this neighborhood? Yes, he does. Does your sister speak English? Yes, she does. Do we have to stay on the late day? Do we have? Do we have? To stay on time late today. Until late. Until late today. Yes, you do. Do they need to find a new job? No, they don't. Does he watch car cartoons? No, he doesn't. Mm -hmm. Very good. Only live. Does your father live in this neighborhood? Okay. Let's see. Thank you, Monica. Thank you very much. Now, another volunteer for B. I, teacher. Okay, you. All right. Please go ahead. Uh, does she read a lot of books? A lot of books. A lot of books. A lot of books. No, she does. No, she doesn't. No, no, she, no she doesn't. Does he work very hard? Yes, she does. Do you have time to study the lesson? Study, study the lesson? Study the lesson? Yes, we do. Does it rain in this region? region? Yes, it's region. Region, does it rain in this region? Region. Does, does it rain in the region? Yes, it does. It does. Mm -hmm. Does it snow here in this time of year? No, it doesn't. No, it does. Mm -hmm. Does it work well? Yes, it does. Yes, it does. Excellent. Thank you, Juan Carlos. Thank you very much. All right, another volunteer for A. Okay, then let's continue. No problem. Your teacher. Who is your? Senia. Levante la mano, pero creo que no la vi. 
No, no se vio nada aquí. No se vio nada. De hecho, ya la bajó. Sí, eh, no. Ah, pues no se ve. Cuando la levanta aquí en la pantallita, aparece la mano levantada. Y también aparece aquí abajo. Ah, ok. No se preocupe. Ahora se ve la mano. Ahora sí se ve la mano. Ok. No problem, my friend. Go ahead. Hey, welcome on board. Señor, welcome on board. Go ahead. Do you study the lesson every day? Yes, I do. Do you, you understand math? No, I don't. Understand? Understand. 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 Mm -hmm. Does your father live in this neighborhood? Yes, he does. Yes, he does. Does, he does. does your sister speak English? Yes, she does. Yes, she does. Yes, she does. Does. Mm -hmm. Does. Do we have to stay until late today? Yes, you do. Do they need to find a new job? No, they don't. Does he wash cartoons? No, he doesn't. No, he doesn't. Okay, excellent. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. All right. B. Would like to do B. Bye. I. Okay, me. Who, who is me? Who's Does. Ah, el Alex. Welcome on board, Alex. Go ahead, my friend. Oh, uh, does she read a lot of books? No, she doesn't. No, she doesn't. Mm -hmm. Does she work very hard? Yes, she does. Do you have time to study the lesson? Where? Yes, we don't. Yes, we do. We yes, we do. Mm -hmm. Does it rain in the region? Yes, I do. Region. Yes, I does. No, yes, yes it does. It does. Mm -hmm. It does. Does it snow here in this time of year? No, it doesn't. No, it doesn't. Mm -hmm. Does it work? Well, yes, it does. Excellent, very good. <coughs> Thank you very much. Thank you, Alex. Okay, some words to pay attention to. Speak, speak, speak. Como su suplando, S -s -s speak. E speak, mm. no. Speak, speak. Stay, stay, es stay, mm. stay, stay. Snow, 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 es snow, no. So, speak, stay, snow, okay? Just for the pronunciation, okay? For the pronunciation. Another volunteer for this one? Okay, no problem. Let's, there are others. Okay, these are WH questions. WH questions, the same because there are three, six, seven, and the others are just six. Why did I write 13? I don't know. 13 is, a, is, a, is not a, a lucky or unlucky number. It's just another number. Okay. So. A. B. A and B. Let me use the hand better. Where do you study the lesson? At home. Where do you live? I live in Ilovasco. Where does your father live? He lives in Sacamín. How does your sister speak English? 
Oh, she speaks it very well. Why do you have to work today? Because we need to finish the project. Who needs to find a new job? Miguel does. Why does he watch cartoons? Because he likes them. What does she read? She reads comics and magazines. Why does she work so hard? because she has a big family. When do you have time to study the lesson? I never do. I never do. How often does it rain in this region? About three times a week. About three times a week. One time, another time, three times this week. About three times a week. When does it snow here? It never does. It never does. Why does it work so well? Because it's new. Why does it work so well? Because it's new. Okay. Everything that is new works well. When it's okay, everything works well. When you are young, your body is new, so it works well. <laughs> it works well. Little by little, it deteriorates, little by little, deteriorates, okay? So, volunteer for A. Hi, teacher. Okay, Juan Carlos, go ahead. Where, where do you study the lesson? Study, study. Where, where do you study the lesson? At home. Where do you live? I live in Ilovasco. Where does your father live? Live. Where father your father live? Yeah. Mm -hmm. He lives in Sacamil. How well does how, your sister? How well? How well does your sister? Speak English. Speak English. Speak English. Oh, she speaks in it very well. Speaks it very well. Mm -hmm. We, why do you have to work today? Because we need to finish the project. Who needs to find? Who needs? Who needs? to find a new job, Miguel does. We does. Why? He, why? why? Why does he watch cartoons? Cartoon? Big cartoons? Cartoon? Cartoons? Because he likes them. Okay, excellent. Thank you very much. Another volunteer? Yes, Monica. Thank you very much. What does she read? She reads comic, comics and magazines. Why does she work so hard? Because she, she has a big family. When do you have time to study the lesson? I never do. How often does, does it rain in this region? Uh, pardon? Region, region. How often does it how, rain? How often does it rain in this region? Region, region, region. About three times a week. Okay. When does it snow here? It never does. Why does it work so well? because it's new. Excellent. Thank you, Monica. Thank you very much. Okay, another volunteer for A. Thank you. Mm -hmm. yes. Will you? Go ahead. Okay. Where do you study the lesson at home? Excuse me? No me escucha. Uh -huh. okay. Hola? Now yes, now yes. Okay. Where 
Where do you study the lesson? At home. Where do you live? I live in Hilo Vasco. Where does your father live? He lives in Sacamil. How well does your sister speak English? Oh, she speaks it very well. Why do you have to work today? Because we need to finish the project. Who needs to find a, a, a new job? Miguel does. Miguel does who? Why, why does he watch cartoons? Because he likes them. Because he likes them. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you very much. Okay. Thank you. Yes, William B. Okay, go ahead. Okay. What does she read? She reads comics and magazines. Why does she work so hard? Because she has a big family. When do you have time to study the lesson? I never do. How often does in rain in the region? Rain, rain in this region. Rain, region. Rain, region. Region, one of the How often does in rain in the region? Does it rain? Rain, does it rain in this region? How often does it rain in this region? How often does in the rain in the region? Region. region about three times a week about three times a week okay when does it snow her here it never does when does it snow here when does it snow here when does it snow here it never does never does excellent why does it work so well because it's new because it's new because it's new Excellent, William. Thank you very much. Okay, another volunteer for A. All right. Yo. Yo. Yo, yo. Okay. Yes, Laurita, go ahead. Vaya. Where do you study the lesson? At home. Where do you live? I live in Ilovasco. Where does your father live? He lives in Sacramento. How well does your sister speak English? Oh, she speak in, speaks, speaks. speaks it very well. Why do you have to work today? Because we need to finish the project, how need to who, who, need, who, who needs who need to find find a new job, job a new job. job. Miguel does. Mm -hmm. Why does he watch cartoons? Mm -hmm. Because he likes them. Okay, excellent. Thank you. Thank you very much. Volunteer for B. I. Okay. Yes. Yelena. What does What does she read? Yeah. She reads comics and a magazine. Why does she work so hard? Because she has a big family. When do you have time to study the lesson? I need. I never do. Never do. How often does it rain? in this re region about three times a week. When does it snow here? It never does. Why does it work so well? Because it's new. Excellent, thank you. Thank you, Maria Elena. Thank you very much. All right. There are no more volunteers, right? So let's move. <clears throat> Pritask. 
prepositions of time, prepositions of time, okay? You remember, yes, teacher, I remember. <clears throat> remember, we use preposition, we use in or not, in, comparte del dia, in the morning, in the afternoon, in the evening. Con meses, months of the year, in September, in October. With years, in 1975, in 1998, in 2021. We use in with seasons, seasons of the year, estaciones del año, seasons of the year, in spring, in the summer, in fall, in winter. Okay, we use on, on with days of the week. Día de la semana, days of the week. On Mondays, on Fridays, on Sundays. Okay, or fechas. Fecha es el mes y el número. Fecha. On September 2nd, on July 4th, on May 10th. Okay, fechas. Or expresiones que representan Días, vacaciones, días feriados, fines de semana, días. So, on holidays, on Mother's Day, on vacations, on weekends. We use at, at, uh, with a specific time. Tiempo específico, specific time. At noon at midnight, at dawn, at sunrise, at sunset. Exact time at 5 a.m., at 7.30 p.m., at 9.45 p.m., okay? Let's remember, let's remember. In the morning, in the afternoon, in the evening, in September, in October, in 1975, in 1998, in 2021, or in 2021, on Mondays, on Fridays, on Sundays, on September 2nd, on July 4th, on May 10th, on holidays, on Mother's Day, on vacations, on weekends, at noon, at midnight, at dawn, at sunrise, at sunset, at 5 a.m., at 7.30 p.m., at 9.45. Okay, so classified, precise time, precise time at, at 3 o'clock, at 10.30 a.m., at noon, at dinner time, at bedtime, at sunrise, at sunset, in or here at the moment, in este momento, at the moment. In months, years, centuries, long periods. Months, meses, years, años, centuries, siglos, siglos, long periods, periodos largos. In May, in summer, or in the summer, in 1990, in the 90s, in the next century, 20th century Fox, you remember, in the next century, in the ice age, in the past, in the future, on days and dates, fechas y días days and dates. On Sunday, on Tuesdays, la S en día significa cada, o sea, ese día repetido. Toda la semana se repite ese día. On Tuesdays, cada Tuesday, every Tuesday. On Tuesdays, every Tuesday. On Sunday, solo una vez. 
solo ese domingo. On Sundays, cada domingo. On Sundays. Si tiene la S, indica repetición. Si no tiene la S, so, sucede una vez nada más. On Sunday, on Tuesdays, on, sixth, on the sixth day of March, on the 25th day of December 2010. British English, en inglés británico, primero el número y después el mes, como aquí. En Estados Unidos, primero va el mes, después el día. March 6th, March the 6th, December the 6th. Podemos escribir un número cardinal, pero es obligatorio decir un número ordinal. 6th, 25th. Okay. On Christmas Day, on Independence Day, on my birthday, on New Year's Eve. <coughs> Antes que pase la siguiente lámina, teacher. Ajá. Eh, la pronunciación en days y um, day, ¿cómo sería? Y, porque se, casi se pronuncian igual. Days and date. Date. Days. And date. Days and... Date. 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 Con práctica va a aprender a pronunciar la T. Ajá. Aquí no hay T, aquí hay T. Ah, pues tomemos, me va a decir. No. Eh, <risa> la letra T. <risa> days. Days. Como que hay que resaltar la, la T en la. En, en la... En date. Date. Days. Date. Days. Date. Ajá. No se preocupen, William. Con práctica, poquito a poquito, poquito a poquito. Eso es okay. cuestión de pronunciación. Igual que la S al inicio. Snow, stay, speak. La S. Poquito a poquito se aprende. Al principio uno dice stay, snow, speak. Poquito a poquito se lo, se lo va quitando y lo va corrigiendo. Cuando se va desarrollando el ruido también, ¿verdad? Ah, exacto. Si se fijan, bueno, esta es la tercera semana ya que terminamos. Pero si se fijan desde el principio, el primer día de clase y a, a ahorita y se comparan cómo estaban, han avanzado. Han avanzado <risa> bastante. Claro, y si algunos otros temitas se pudieran haber incluido, habrían reforzado algunas otras cosas. Pero no hay tiempo porque solo son cuatro semanas. Entonces, ahí es el asunto. Solo nos, nos queda una semana. Okay. Eso sí. Pero vamos a estar juntos solo, es, solo una semana más. Por eso van a tener otro teacher y... Un tipo bueno que no lo regañe. Ok, y, 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 y va a estar. Ok. Lo vamos a extrañar, teacher. Cree. Sí, hombre. Yo lo voy a extrañar a ustedes. Bueno. Yo sé que todos los módulos íbamos a estar con usted. Ay, tan chula. No, se va a aburrir. <risa> Tan feo este indio, imagínense, tan feo y que la tenga que aguantar todos los módulos, no. El otro teacher dicen que no explica como usted. No, el otro es cariñoso. Ajá. No, no, solo en inglés y no explica, eh, no aclara bien este, eh, las palabras que uno no entiende. Si lo agarró, lo agarró y si no, pues lo vemos en la siguiente clase. Ay, tan bonito Wilbert. No, le voy a explicar bien bonito, ya van a ver. Bien bonito. No se preocupe. Okay. Bueno, yo lo felicito porque, bueno, yo solo escuchando porque me cuesta pronunciar las palabras, pero sí veo que explica bien. Lo felicito. Wilber, es muy amable, gracias. Y espero que lo poquito que estoy logrando hacer le ayude. Okay. Ese es mi verdadero deseo, que le sirva. Eso es lo importante. Ok, thank you.
Thank you. Thank you very much. Gracias, gracias a usted. Okay, thanks. Okay, um, task preparation, prepositions of time. Vamos a recordar prepositions of time. In, ¿qué dijimos que se usaba in? Días. Días, fechas. Month. Años. Month. Usa con meses y años. Años. Month, years, años. century. Century. Meses y estaciones del año. Estaciones del año. ¿Qué otra cosa? Parte del día, ¿se acuerdan? In the morning, in the afternoon. In the, afternoon. In the, in the morning, in the afternoon, in the evening. Uh -huh. Yeah. Months. In September, in October, in July. Years. In 1975, in 1998, in 2021, in 2022, okay, in 1977, in 1982, etc. Years. Mm -hmm. On. Usamos on con, con cuáles? Week. Ajá. Uh -huh. Weekends. On weekends. weekends. On weekends. On holidays. On holidays. Días. Días especiales. Con, con, sí. Mother's Day. Mother's Day. También con fechas, con números. Ajá. O septiembre, o octubre. Octubre eh, first. Días feriados, dijo, ¿verdad? Días feriados, sí, días feriados. On holidays. On holidays. En mm -hmm. vacation. <ríe> que yo lo estuve enseñando. Susi, hello. On vacation. Vacation. On vacation. On va vacation. On vacations. Excellent. On vacations. Very good. So, at. We use at. Tiempo exacto. Tiempo. At three o'clock, at four o'clock, at 6.30, at 5.30, at. The moment at dawn, at, at noon, at noon, at sunrise, at sunset, at noon, at midnight. Uh -huh. At excellent. Okay, eso lo van a hacer en los grupitos. Los voy a mandar al grupito y ahí practiquen. Write the preposition, complete with in, on, at. Okay. Let's see. Stop sharing. How many are we? Um, 15. Let me see. Three groups, five, no, too many. Four groups, four groups. Permissions, permissions. Four groups. The groups are created. Okay. The groups are open. Complete with in on at. Okay. Juan Carlos is in room two. Okay. Ahí va. Gracias. Yo voy. Vaya, ya lo logré. Eh, ¿Cómo se llama? Eh, conectar. Bueno. Eh, vamos a llenar la verdad. Sí, correcto. Este de aquí sería. Ahí sería. Sí, sí ¿verdad? Sí, sí. Eh, me escribe, escribe cosa, escribe. Escribe esta voy. Uh, hoy sí. In. Aquí sería. Aquí lo veo. Aquí 
en agosto. Hmm. Seguro, seguro. Porque ya está dando un día específico. Sí, tiene razón. Bueno, Ajá. ahí sería este. Pom. Creo que sí, ¿verdad? Ajá, Pom. Pom sería. Aquí sería On Friday, ¿verdad? Ajá. ¿Y aquí? Hola. Ahí es. Ahí, on. Ahí es. On. 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 Free day. Free day. Free day. Night. Day. I go night. out on Friday. Friday. At night. Uh -huh. At midnight. At midnight. At noon. She has lunch at noon. I finish work. At sun. At sunset. Sunset. At sunset. Mm. 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 Y la otra, she study, studies English at night. At night, mm -hmm. I, go I go to the bed. I, pardon, I go, okay. I go to bed on meaning, meaning, or, or at, on or at, at, creo. At, at, creo. At meaning. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Wilber, ¿y usted no va a decir? <risa> no, yo solo las escucho. No, tiene que practicar. Mm. Sigan leyendo, despuesito, voy a ver si me animo. Bye. <risa> He has lunch. No sé qué será, no. No, hizo de que era como... Mediodía. En la atardecer, algo así. Mediodía, noon. Mediodía. Recuerden que sí. anoche es midnight. Noon, midnight. Mediodía. Uh -huh. mediodía. ¿Cómo se pronuncia midnight? Midnight. 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 Entonces sería, she has lunch in noon. O at noon. At noon. At, at noon. Okay. I finish work. To bed at midnight. She has lunch at noon. noon. I finish work at sunset. She gets up at sunrise. He takes a shower. 6 a.m. She celebrates her birthday on October 6 I travel abroad on in vacation. On vacation. On, on vacation. On vacation. I have a vacation in August. It starts all August first. I got out on Friday. Um, she study English at night. 
I go to bed at midnight. She has lunch at noon. I finish work at sunset. She gets up at sunrise. She takes a shower at 6 a.m. She celebrates her birthday on October. Thirty first, thirty first, thirty first. I travel abroad on vacation. No sé si hay otra laminita o solo esta. Finch. <laughs> Okay. No, no hay, solo esta página era. Solo la 21. Ok. Uh, Entonces yeah. sigamos. Yeah. I had the kitchen in, in the out. Oh, ah, in August. In August. Okay. In August. In August, ok. Okay, we have 13, 14, 15. Okay, excellent. Now, before we get to the task practice, because the next one is a ta task practice, we have something else to do. Over here, Let's see. First, review. Vamos a revisar unas cositas primero. Let's begin with days of the week. Days of the week. Week. Semana. Days. Okay. And what do we say? First day of the week. Sunday. Sunday. Monday. Monday. Tuesday. 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 Wednesday, Wednesday, Wednesday. Thursday, Thursday, Thursday. Friday, Friday, Friday. Saturday, 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 
Saturday. Days of the week, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Seasons of the year. Seasons of the year. Seasons of the year. Seasons. Estaciones del año. Estaciones del año. How many seasons of the year are there? How many seasons? Cuánta estaciones? How many seasons? Four. Four stations. Four, Four, Four stations. Station. Four seasons. Four seasons. Hay un grupo que así se llama, un grupo de música. Un grupo ah. musical, Four Seasons. Frankie Valli era el cantante. Era el cantante. Four Seasons. Ok, we have Seasons of the Year. Empezamos. Enero es Winter. So, empezamos con Winter. Winter. Spring. Summer, fall, for, for, para los americanos, fall, para los británicos, autumn, fall, autumn, winter, spring, summer, fall, autumn, winter, spring, summer, fall, autumn, winter, spring, Summer, fall, autumn. Days, okay, months of the year. Month of the year. January. January. February, March, April, 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 May, June, June, July, July, August, 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 September, September, September. October, October, November, no, November, November, December, January, February, March, April, May, June, July, August, September, October, November, December. Okay. Volunteer to read the days of the week. Yes, Monica. Yeah. Thank you, Monica. Days of the week, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Wednesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Saturday. Very good. Thank you, Monique. Thank you very much. Okay. Volunteer to read seasons, seasons of the year. Yeah. Okay, please go ahead, Susie. 
seasons of, of the year? Winter, spring, 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 summer, eh, esa no me acuerdo. Fall, 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 fall. No, no recuerdo. Autumn, 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 autumn. Fall, autumn. Fall, fall, autumn. autumn. Uh -huh. Winter, spring, spring, summer, summer fall, autumn. autumn. Uh -huh. Excellent. Thank you, Susie. Thank you very much. Okay. Volunteer for the months of the year. Hi, teacher. Thank you, Juan Carlos. Go ahead, please. Months of the year. January, February, March, April, May, June, July, August. August, August. August. Mm -hmm. Yes, Juan Carlos. You may continue. Okay. Se le cortó el compañero, ya no está. Ya no está. Thank you. So, yes, Monica. Months of the year. January, February, March, April, May, June, July, August, September, October, November, December. Excellent. Thank you very much. Volunteers to read the days of the week. Hi. Uh -huh. Okay, please go ahead. Sunday, Sunday. Monday. Mm -hmm. Tuesday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Tuesday, Tuesday. Okay, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Thursday, mm -hmm. Thursday, th Thursday, first, first day. It's a difficult sound for us. Uh -huh. Thursday, first day, first day, Friday, Fr Friday, Friday, Friday. 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 It's Saturday. Saturday. Yes, thank you very much. Volunteer for seasons of the year. Yo, teacher. Yes, Jacobo, go ahead. Please. Okay. Season of the year. Winter, spring, spring. summer, eh, fall. Eh, ese sino, autumn. 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 Autumn, yes. Okay. Okay, excellent. Very good. Months of the year, volunteer for months of the year. Aye. Yes, please, go ahead. Months of the year, January, February, March, April, May, June, July, August, September, October, November, and December. Yes, thank you, Maria Elena. Thank you very much. Okay, let's move on, let's continue. Teacher, listen. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Ordinal numbers. Yes, Alex, thank you. 
let's go to the attendance. Hmm? Let's go to the attendance. Alex. Present teacher. Excellent. Carolina. Present teacher. Excellent. Edgardo Ernesto González. Ed. Present. Ed, eh, Edgardo. No, Edwin. Ah, Edgardo, ahorita. Ok. Pensé que me ha mencionado ya. No, no, todavía no. But ahorita, ahorita. Está bien, no problem. Thank you, Edwin. Jacobo de Jesús Gómez. Present teacher. Excellent. Y Juan Carlos Morales. <coughs> Karen Elizabeth Ramos. Presente. Excellent. Laura Guadalupe Fuentes. Presente. Excellent. Nice. Luis Alberto Olano. Present. Yes. Okay. Welcome on board. Okay. María Elena Linares. Present. Excellent. Maritza Lisette Morales. Mónica Maricela Martinez. Present. Excellent. Senia Judith Peña. Present. Excellent. Susana Francisca Maya. Susie. Present teacher. Excellent. Nice. William Alexander Ramirez. Presente. Excellent. Nice. Yanira Patricia Díaz. Yanni didn't come today, right? So. Emerson Eli Morales. No, Emerson Eli Moreira. Presente. Excellent. Kelly Elizabeth Padilla. Kelly disappeared. Tatiana Vanessa Escobar. Tatiana didn't come here. Okay. So Tatiana and Yanira didn't come here. And Edgardo. Three people. Okay. Good. Continue, my friends. Cardinal numbers. Let's see. One. Two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, not in German, eight, nine, ten. Okay. Second group, 11, 12, 13, Fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen.
18. Nineteen, twenty, third group, Ten, twenty, thirty, forty, fifty. Sixty, seventy, eighty, ninety. One hundred, one hundred cardinal numbers. Los car cardinal numbers sirven para contar. Uno, dos, tres, cuatro, cinco. Ordinal numbers son para, para indicar en qué posición están. Primero, segundo, tercero, cuarto, quinto, etc. Okay. Let's see. You. You will say, teacher, son los mismos. No. And you will see. Okay. Esto es para que vean el contraste. Intencionalmente tenemos uno, pero el eh, ordinal number es oops, sí, first, first, teacher falta la r, sí, first, no, first, first. First, ok, ese es first, el primero, pero ¿cuáles son las últimas dos letras? ST. Entonces es lo que le ponemos al número, ST. Y eso va 30 grados arriba, entonces pongamos. First, quitemos. Ok. ¿Este cómo se llama? Second. 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 Yes. Second. Fuera second. Dicen en boxeo. Ok. ¿Y usamos qué letras? ¿Cuáles son las dos letras? ND. ND. Second. Ok.
second. Okay, este es third. 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 Y usamos cuáles son las últimas dos letras? R D R D. R D. R D. Okay. Okie dokie. Y a estos niñitos de aquí solo les agregamos H. H. Fourth. Y esas son las últimas dos letras. Se las ponemos aquí. Fourth. Fourth. Ok. This one también cambia. Le quitamos la E y la V y le ponemos F. TH. ¿Cuáles son las últimas dos letras? TH. Lo subimos. Queda TH. Este, solo TH. Y vamos a hacer lo demás con los demás. TH. Pero vaya, ¿qué pasa con el 8? Termina en T. ¿Qué hacemos? ¿Le ponemos doble T y H? No. Solo le agregamos la H. Solo la H. ¿Cuáles son las últimas dos letras? TH. ¿Qué pasa con el 9? Le volamos la E. Teacher, se la volamos. Sí. Le eliminamos la E. Y le ponemos TH. ¿Y qué pasa con TEN? También. Y TH. Ahora vamos a ponerle los TH a todos. Todos terminan en TH. Todos vamos a, van a llevar TH. ¿Cómo suena la TH? Con la lengüita entre los dientes decimos tenf, 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 ok, ninth, eighth, seventh, sixth, fifth, fourth, may the fourth be with you, que el 4 de mayo esté con usted, no, que la fuerza lo acompañe. May the fourth be with you. So, ok, ¿qué pasa con todos estos? Todos estos tienen TH. Entonces, solo vamos a poner la TH y después lo cambiamos. Veamos. TH. Pero este termina como el 5, ¿verdad? VE. ¿Qué pasa? Bye bye. This. Y le agregamos FTH. This one, TH. This one, TH. This one, TH. This one, TH. TH. This one, TH. TH. What happens with 20? 20 termina con Y. ¿Qué hacemos? Bye bye. Esta le ponemos I, E, T, H. 20. Ahora pongamos las T, H a todos. T, H.
pH. Okay. Okay, excellent. Vamos con el último que vamos a necesitar en este caso. Vamos a ver. Primero vamos a este 20. Oops, I forgot to remove. Like this. Okay, pH, pH, y a ese que le ponemos, RD, 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 ND, y la Marta me gustó, ¿no? y ese carro está en súper buenas condiciones, man. Pero yo sé que es muy, es muy caro, pues. O sea, Ajá. no. Ok. This is. ¿Por qué en 11, en 12 y en 13 no cambian? ¿Cómo así? Porque este 21, 22 y 23 sí cambian como primero, segundo y tercero. Ah. Y en 11, 12 y 13, ¿por qué no? ¿Cómo decimos 11? Oh, por la pronunciación. 11. 11. Ajá. ¿Y cómo decimos 12? 12. ¿Cómo decimos 13? 13. ¿Pero cómo decimos 21? 12. First. Ah, por el 1. Ya entendí. Second. Okay. Third. Y así todo con 31st, 32nd, 33rd. Con la pronunciación del 1. 42nd, 46nd. Ok. Ya. Yeah. 21st. Oops. Oops. Ok. Bueno, allow me to be lazy. Por el tiempo, vamos a hacer alargar. Solo copiar. Fíjate, pero no es lo mismo. Si no es lo mismo poner solo uno, estar poniendo todos los demás. Ok. Aquí vamos con el primero. 21st is ok. But this is not 21st. This is 22nd. This is 23rd. 24th. Twenty-fifth. Ven, más fácil. Uh -huh. Ok.
exactly vamos con el otro serie serie oops I forgot serie Series. And the last one, teacher and yes, yeah. Okay, okay, okay. Estos ya los practicamos, pero se los voy a pronunciar porque no vamos a practicar esto, sino esto por el tiempo. Tenemos que ir a la última actividad. Ok. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, ten, twenty, thirty, forty, fifty, sixty, seventy, eighty, ninety, one hundred. Okay, esta es la que vamos a practicar. First. Second, third, fourth, fifth, sixth, seventh, eighth, ninth, tenth, eleventh, twelfth, thirteenth, fourteenth, fifteenth, sixteenth, seventeenth, eighteenth, nineteenth, twentieth. 21st, 22nd, 23rd, 24th, 25th, 30th, 31st, 31st. Ok. ¿Por qué usamos estos? Estos van con los meses. January 1st, July 2nd, September 19th, August 21st, October 31st. Volunteer to read the first 10. Hi, teacher. Yes, please. Go ahead. Me, 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 me. Juan Carlos. Juan Carlos. Go ahead, Juan Carlos. First, second, third, fourth, fourth, five, fourth, fourth, five, if fifth fifth six six mm -hmm. seven seventh eight eight ninth tenth tenth uh -huh. okay ten tenth. 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 tenth very good thanks volunteer for this one Yes, Monica. Hi, teacher. Okay. Monica. 11th, 12th, 13th, 14th, 15th, 16th, 17th, 18th, 19th, 20th. ¿Cómo sería ese? 18th, 19th, 20th. 20th. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Thank you. There was a boy saying me. Who was saying me? Había un chico diciendo me. ¿Quién era?
Okay, volunteer for the last seven. Okay, then let's continue, no problem. Let's go to the presentation, task practice, okay? We're going to be doing pages 17, 18, in 19, okay, tres. Okay, la primera, transform into yes, no questions. You have a meeting at nine, question. Do you have a meeting at night, at 9 a.m.? Okay, make information questions at 5.30 a.m. Time, what time does Jack take a shower? What time does Jack take a shower at 5.30 a.m.? The last one, the same. When or what time? Okay. When do you relax? When do you relax? Uh, on weekends. When do you, when does she watch TV? At night. What time do you go out? No, what time don't you go out? In the, what time don't you go out at, in the evening at six, etc. Pero aquí pueden hacer la pregunta afirmativa. What time do you go out in the evening? Okay, but it's why don't you go out? What time don't you go out in the evening? Okay, that's it. So one, two, three. Let's go and do it. Let's go to the groups. Groups. The groups are opening. Let's join. Let's join. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, Alex is in room in room two. Okay. Ernest, ah, Edgar, okay. Edwin, Emerson, okay. Hola. Diga. Marisa. Hola. 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 ¿Qué dijo? Hola. Hoy sí, Marisa, sí. te escuchamos. Hoy sí. Sí, hoy sí. Sí. Ok. No, no, ¿Qué tenemos que utilizar? Practice, my dear ones. Aquí es donde vamos a utilizar esta parte, ¿verdad? Sí. Eh, ¿Quién inicia primero? Inicia alguno de ustedes, porque yo bajo ahorita. No me agarra mucho la idea. Vaya, eh, ¿qué digo? What time does Jack takes a shower? No, takes Ajá. a shower, ok. Takes a shower. Eh, at... Entonces... Si alguien va a decir, ya te a shower at 5.30 yen. Uh -huh. Ah, o sea, como lo que hicimos la vez pasada, ¿verdad? Sí, algo así. Uh -huh. 
Lo vamos a preguntar sí. con Juan, con Gwen. Y hay que contestar. Aquí es donde se usa Gwen o, o War. War time, ¿verdad? Ajá. Correcto. Pero aquí. Igual creo yo que. Pero. Vaya. Aquí iría What Time, Bet, Betty, Lit. No, aquí sería. ¿Cuál sería aquí? Uh, where does lead? Betty creo que sería, ¿verdad? Sí. Where, where living, where living Betty, o where, sí, así, Betty living. No, pero lleva, lleva el das, pero está preguntando. Where does Betty live? ¿Dónde vive Betty? Ajá. Uh -huh. Entonces, Betty lives in San Salvador. Sí, así es. Aquí, es, se, en, 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 en este día de abajo, ¿cómo sería? Sería Gwen. Gwen, ¿cuándo Jack and Billy play soccer? Ya yo sé, Jack and Billy play soccer on weekends. ¿Cuándo? ¿Qué es lo que está sur? ¿Qué es lo que está en amarillo? Soccer. soccer. Entonces, ¿cuál es la pregunta? Si ellos juegan fútbol. Ajá, entonces, ¿cómo se <risa> Ok. What, what do Jack what? play? What do Jack and play. Billy play soccer? What, no. What do no. Jack and Bill play on weekends? Play. Oh, on weekends. No incluimos la respuesta en la pregunta. ¿Qué color era el caballo blanco de Napoleón? No. <ríe> no incluimos la, la respuesta en la pregunta. Entonces, después. Sí, sí, sí. Lo amarillo no lo incluimos en la pregunta. Lo amarillo no lo incluimos en la pregunta. Sí, no. ah, entonces sería. What. What. Do. Do. Ya. En play. En Bill. Play. play on weekend. Ok, sería. ¿Qué es lo que juega? Ya vivir cada semana. Ya. Yeah. Ya. Yeah. 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 Does he? Ah, no, es inglés. Ajá, porque ahí lo que pregunta es que si en Inglaterra en diciembre nieva. nieva. Uh -huh. Pues ahí sí, no sé, yo creo que sí. <laughs> yes. What's the question? Es que pasamos in how often? No. So, solo son yes no questions. Entonces solo no, no entiendo. Va, pasamos England al final y decimos Does it often? Does it often snow in December in England? Does it often snow? Does it often snow in December in England? Or podemos dejar allí England. O sea que aquí está la respuesta, solamente que no está subrayada. Así, como la de abajo. No, aquí la, estamos haciendo una transformación. Estamos transformando uh -huh. estas oraciones en preguntas. Sí. Ajá, vaya, pero la primera la, la hice así. No sé si está bien, porque... Está bien. Ah, ok. Entonces sí la estamos transformando en preguntas. Sí. Porque le agregó do y el question mark. Entonces aquí, ¿qué es lo que hace? Lo mismo. Do y el question mark. Solo que esta es tercera persona. Entonces, does. Uh -huh. Does the shop close at midnight? Does Jane usually go home on, at lunchtime? Uh -huh. Entonces, sí. In England, in England, does it snow 
in December? In England, does it snow in December? In England, does... In England, y hay pausa, porque hay coma. In England, does it snow in December? Does it, ya entendí, el does va con it. Sí. Ok, ya entendí. Does it snow in December? Ok. Y... Do La otra igual. Hat. He does, plans. Does... Does he plan plans to, to travel, travel in the future? Yeah. Do we have a lot of problems in this century? A lot of problems? Do we a lot of problems. Do we have a lot of problems in this century? Do you have a lot of problems in this century? Do we? We? Do we? Y la otra sería, does she work on Mondays? Does she work on Mondays? Does she work on Mondays? Mm -hmm. Excellent. Continue. Does here bring this? Thursday. Thursday is on November. Uh, I... November 20. ¿Cómo es? 12. 20. 12. 20. 20. 20. Cayeron 20. en la trampa. Cayeron en la trampa. Yes. ¿Por qué? Yeah. Va. Vean la oración. Sí, es cierto. Pero que hers no son ellos. No. Él, ella. Es, sus, estamos hablando de ella. Su cumpleaños. Su cumpleaños. Ella. El cumpleaños de ella. Por eso es das here. No. No. Entonces, ¿cómo es do hers? Das she. No. No. Verbo to be, entonces el verbo to be no usa das. El verbo entonces solo es her. Is her birthday. Is, ah, es que con to be es is. Is her birthday on November the 20th. Ah, es cierto, es en algún lado. Ajá, es que esos son my, your, is, here, it's, or, are, their, your. Ajá. Ok, del verbo to be, ¿verdad? Sí. No, 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 no. Este, este, no, no, no. es el sustituto. Los posesivos son posesivos. Ajá. Uh -huh. to be es is, are, am. Um, uh -huh. I do, is he, is she. Ok. Ok. Y la otra, uh -huh. la siete sería, ¿verdad? Entonces sería, today, go on Saturday night. Eh, sería la yes, no question, pero la respuesta tiene que ser lo amarillo. Ajá, ¿verdad que sí? La respuesta es lo amarillo. Entonces, ¿cuál es la pregunta? They, do they, they sería, ¿verdad? Do they, mm, no. Do they, pero ahorita estamos con qué tipo de preguntas? Information question. Mm. Entonces, ¿cuál es la pregunta? What do they do on Saturday night? What do they do? Aquí se sustituye esto por do. What do they do? ¿Qué hacen? ¿Qué hacen el sábado por la noche? They go dance. Mm -hmm. What do they do on Saturday night? What? ¿Y cómo hicieron las, las otras? Nosotros las estamos haciendo con do y das. No, esa es la, esa es la primera parte. Ah. Es otro ejercicio ya. Y tiene instrucciones diferentes. Okay. Okay. Empecemos desde la uno. <laughs> Let's go to number one. Okay. Mm -hmm. Make. Yeah. Ajá. At five. Okay. Recuerden el modelo que les di, verdad? What time? De tiempo. Sería de tiempo. What time does? What time does Jack take a shower? Exactly. Mm -hmm. And number two. Where does 
Betty live. La, live ever. Live. Live. Mm. Where does Betty live? So where does Betty live? In number three. Sería aquí. Gwen, ¿verdad? No, porque la, lo que está en amarillo es soccer. Uh, sería what? Ajá. What? What Jack and Billy what do, do on weekends? What, what do Jack, what do Jack, Jack and Billy play? Play. What Jack and Bill play on weekends. La respuesta sería soccer. ¿Qué es lo que juega Jack y Billy los fines de semana? Exacto. What do Jack and Bill play on week? Mm -hmm. okay. La cuatro sería parecida, sería igual, ¿verdad? Mm -hmm. What? What? Do. Do. Mm -hmm. Cecilia and Vilma eat for dinner on Saturdays. Pupusas. Pupusas. La, la cinco sería. When. When I go I, out. Every. How often. Uh, how mm -hmm. often do I go out? How often do you go out? Mm, do you go out? How often do you go out? Saturday. I go out every Saturday night. How mm. often do you go out? ¿Con qué frecuencia sales? Mm -hmm. Salgo cada fin de semana, o sea, cada sábado por la noche. All right, excellent. Continue. Continue. Gracias. Ahí sería. Okay. Make information question. In era... Example. What time? What what time Jack take a shower? What time does Jack take uh, a shower? What time does Jack uh, take a shower? Take a shower. In number two. Number two, this, uh, vamos a ver, primero dice, Betty lives in, lives. When does Betty live? Where is, where does Betty live? Where does Betty lives? Live. Where does Betty live? In San Salvador. Three. In Jack and Bill play soccer on weekend. Mm -hmm. When, mm -hmm. what, when, what, 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 play? Do, what do Jack and Bill play weekends? What, what, what do Jack and Bill play? What do, what do Jack and Bill play on weekends? Oh, weekend. uh, yes, uh, yes, yes. yes. Soccer. Mm -hmm. What do they play? What do they play on weekends? Soccer. Uh -huh. In number four is one. Uh -huh. How do we do four? What do Cecilia and Vilma eat for dinner on Saturday? Perfect. Excellent. Okay. Yes. Number five. Fíjense sí, que number five dice every. Entonces, ¿cuál es la pregunta? How often? How often? How often what? Como es, oh. este es I, entonces la pregunta es you. Entonces, ¿cómo va? How, how often you how, go out? How often do, do you, how do you do go out? Uh, how often do you go out? How often do you go out? I go out every Saturday night. Exactly. How do you? Okay. Six. Yeah. To the stadium. Es un lugar, ¿verdad? Sí. ¿Cuál es la pregunta? When. Where. Where. 
Where? Where? Ah. Where does Jack? Where? Where does? Where? The... Where? Where does? Where? Does go? Porque el auxiliar go. ese ya está en el auxiliar. The go. Where does go. Jack go? Every Sunday. Every day. Every Sunday. Where does Jack go every Sunday? Uh-huh. Excellent. Nice. Continue, my friends. Continue. Okay. Or what time? Or what ah, time? what time sería ahí? What? <laughs> sí, cuánto tiempo? What time is eso? O qué tiempo es? <laughs> What, what, okay. what? what time is it? La 13. Sí. 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 No. How long? Ah, how long? How, how long? Okay. How long do they play video games on Sunday? How long do they play video games on Sundays? Sunday. Por eso no andamos algo perdido entonces. Porque si la, la mencionamos, va. How long or how often do they play? Pero leí Bumab. Sí. Y, no y que no es as how often. No. No, es que. ¿Cuánto how tiempo often, es how long? Was? La 12 sí es how often. How often does she study the lesson? Ah, how often. How often does she study the lesson? Every day. ¿Con qué frecuencia estudia la lección, verdad? Ah, ya. Yeah. Todos los días. Ajá. Días. Yeah. How long they play the video games? Uh -huh. Number 10. How did you do number 10? <laughs> y la 10, ¿cómo la hice? No. La 10. La 10. La 10. <laughs> eh, why? Why very study? No, number very. 10. La 10. Ah, la, la 10. La, ah, también con why. Uh -huh. why? Why, why, why do? does Jack work? Why? Why does Jack work? Why does, uh -huh. just work, does Jack work? Because he needs the money, okay? Of course, obvious, right? Why does Jack work? Because he needs the money. Mm -hmm. Continue, my friends. Now let's go to the next slide. Pasamos a esto. Sí. O sí. Vale. Ay, la primera. Yo uso la... Y sería what time. Mm. Creo que sería Gwen. Sí. ¿Cuándo te relajas? ¿Cuándo te relajas? <coughs> ¿Cuál sería when, when do you usually relax? Uh -huh. ¿O cuánto? Ah, cu ¿cuándo? Pregunta. Ajá, ¿cuándo? Sí, ¿Cuándo bueno. te, te relajas? Te relaja. ¿Cuándo te relajas? Ajá. Ajá, te relaja. On weekend, los fines de semana. Va a ser ya en la hora de abajo. Eh, but no sería, no, no tiene compañeras en la 1. Entonces el de Jack, entonces, entonces el Jack va a cambiar. Está hablando de estadio. Es un no, lugar. Siempre Gwen. Mm, podría también us, podría usarse. Es que yo creo que se, porque se puede combinar con los dos. También podríamos usarlo donde. Si, si contestamos que va al estadio. ¿Cuál es lo amarillo? Es la María, es la respuesta, si no me equivoco. Sí, entonces la, la, la pregunta está basada en la respuesta. No me gusta, ¿no? Ajá, es que así la formula. Pero yo tengo, ajá, eso es lo que estaba entendiendo yo, que aquí dice que va al ¿Cuál estadio. Es la, ¿Cuál es la pregunta? What's the question? Jack va, ¿dónde va Jack todos los sábados? ¿En inglés? Jack. Uh, yo, yo digo que es where 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 porque where does Jack porque, porque every ¿Dónde va él? Sería how often 
Y este no está subrayado, no está en amarillo. Ajá, por Todo eso. Este está en amarillo. Y la, la pregunta está basada en lo amarillo. Ajá, que es ah, today entonces, study. Where does, where does Jack go? Ajá. Every Sunday. Every Sunday. He, uh, he uh, to the study. He goes to the stadium. Ah, la respuesta sería to the stadium. To the stadium. Ah, ya entendí. Ajá, es que las amarillas son las respuestas. Entonces ellos eh, los hacen los qué? ¿Qué hacen los que hacen ellos los sábados por la noche? Excellent, excellent, no, excellent. Uh -huh. Entonces sería qué? What? Uh -huh. what? What? What do they? What do they do? What do they do? What do they do? What do they do? Um, go on, on son, Sunday night. On Saturday night. What on do sa on Saturday night? Saturday night. Mm -hmm. uh, entonces sería um, eh, go, no, do solo go dance. What do they do on Saturday night? Go dance. Go dancing. Go dancing. What do they do on Saturday night? Go dancing. Go dancing. Oh, yes. Entonces, eh, tú, no, eso también sería bueno. Juegan. ¿Cuándo ellos juegan soccer? When do they? When, when do they, do play, they soccer? play soccer? On, they play soccer on Sundays. On Sundays. Sundays. Exactly. Sundays. They play soccer on Sunday. Okay. Betty every night. Listen to music. Ah, escucha. ¿Qué hace? ¿Qué hace? ¿Cuándo? When does Betty? When does Betty? Betty. No. Betty, ¿qué hace? No. Ajá, exactly. Ajá. Entonces, ¿cuál es la pregunta? When or what? Oh. ¿Qué? What? 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 What does Betty every night? What does Betty do every night? Do? Mm -hmm. ¿Por qué tú? Porque hacer. hacer. Es del verbo hacer. Oh, oh, oh. Yes. Do yes. every night. Listen ah. to music. Listen to music. Uh -huh. What does Betty do every night? What does Betty do every night? Listen to music. Listen to music. Uh -huh. okay. Exactly. Aquí está el teacher ya. Yes, Emerson. Hi, teacher. I have a question. Ajá, tell me. Eh, es que teníamos la duda de que no se nos había quedado muy bien. Este, digamos, como por ejemplo, en la número 8, como está hablando de una tienda, es algo. Entonces decíamos con mis compañeras que sería it. It. Ah, perdón. Sería what time. Does what time does it store open on ¿Por Saturday? ¿Por qué it? Porque habla de una tienda. Sí, pero no necesitan cambiarlo. Stores está en plural, es day, pero no necesitan, no necesitan cambiarlo. Solo lo que necesitan es hacer la pregunta. Y para ¿Cómo sería? Para hacer la pregunta, se fijan cuál es lo amarillo. At 7.30. Sería what time. Ah, uh -huh. what time do stores open uh -huh. on Saturday? What time do stores open on Saturday? Uh -huh. Y la 11. It doesn't rain in the summer. In the summer is... Es la respuesta. Ajá. Uh -huh. Entonces, Entonces sería when... When, when do it? When does it? When does it rain? Ahí sería negativa, porque es negativa. When does it rain in the summer? No. When does it rain in the summer? Ah, uh -huh. uh -huh. When does uh -huh. it rain? Cuando no llueve. When uh -huh. does it rain? Uh -huh. In the summer. When ah, okay, teacher. Does it when does it rain? rain? 
Y la ocho, solo para que me quede claro, ¿cómo era? What, what time? Do stores open? O si no, podemos hacer negativa. What time don't stores open on Saturday? Ah, ajá, ajá. Sí, Pero, porque en la once sí lo, sí lo cambió. Sí. Se Pero, puede hacer eso. What time do stores open? Pero como mm. 7.30, no. Entonces es what time don't stores open. Don't store open. Sí. La okay. próxima vez me voy a acordar. De, Thank you. Ok. Me voy a acordar de no ponerles negativas para hacer preguntas. Porque uh -huh. es chivo late. Okay. Thank eh. you, teacher. You're Thank welcome. You. I understand. Ok. No problem. It's ok. Bueno, entonces, el... when, you, when you usually relax. Relax, yes. Relax. 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 Uh -huh. When you usually relax. When do you usually relax? Después de when, siempre va el auxiliar. Do. When do you usually relax? When do you usually relax? Usually relax. Y en la segunda es, when does? When do you usually relax? On weekends. When does she watch TV? When, watch TV. When does she watch TV? When does she does TV? When does At she night. Watch TV. When does she watch TV? At night. At night. Ok, entonces. Eh, when do you have lunch? When do you have, do you have lunch? At noon. At noon. Okay. What time do you not go out? Ow. What time? What time? Don't you go out? Gone. What time? Don't you go out? What don't you go Don't you go out? Don't you out? In the evening. What time don't you go out? In the evening. At evening. At evening. At six. At six. Okay, we are 15. Let's pay, let's call the roll. Alex Enoch Ramirez. Present teacher. Excellent. Carolina Stephanie Hernandez. Present teacher. Excellent, nice. Edgardo Ernesto Gonzalez. Present teacher. Excellent, nice. Edwin Ernesto Fabian. Present. Excellent, nice. Jacob Jesus Gomez. Present teacher. Excellent, nice. Juan Carlos Morales. Present teacher. Nice, very good. Karen Elizabeth Ramos. Señorita Karen. Se fue porque se sentía mal, me dijo. Sí, yo creo que se sentía mal. No sí. estuvo participando mucho. No, se sentía mal, me dijo que se iba a salir porque le dolía demasiado la cabeza. Ay, pobrecita. Con que no sea COVID. Okay. Sí. Laura Guadalupe Fuentes. Presente. Nice. Luis Alberto Olano. Present. Nice, very good. María Elena Linares. Present. Excellent, good. Maritza Lisette Morales. Present. Excellent, very good. Monica Maricela Martinez. Present. Excellent, good. Senia Judith Peña. Present. Excellent, very good. Susana Francisca Maya. Present, teacher. Excellent, nice. 
Wilber Fernando Aquino. Presente. Excelente. Nice. William Alexander Ramírez. Presente. Very good. Elvira Patricia Díaz. No, didn't come today, right? So. Emerson Elí Moreira. Kelly Elizabeth Padilla. And Tatiana Vanessa Escobar. Y hoy se queda conmigo. Ricardo. Ok, si no hay Ricardo, entonces. Bueno. Ladies and gentlemen, en la colita que queda del video, le voy a hacer las preguntas, le voy a resolver las preguntas de lo que tienen las partes amarillas. Hoy, ahí ven esa parte del video porque ahí le voy a estar haciendo la, voy a estar resolviendo, ya que no hay nadie que se quede, porque hoy no, hoy no le toca a nadie quedarse, hoy le toca a Ricardo. Teacher, justo. Justo cuando empezó a pasar lista me sacó, así que presente, soy Emerson. Hola Emerson, mucho gusto. Hola. Hola. Ah. Hola. Nice to meet you, teacher. Nice to meet you, my friend. No, no se preocupe, yo le había puesto presente porque yo sé que ha estado fallando el internet, pero lo he estado viendo allí, ¿verdad? Entonces sé que han estado presentes. No se preocupe, my friend. Don't ah, ok, thank you, teacher. Ok. So, my dear niñitos, thank you very much. Eh, go to do the homework. Mañana tengo que subir las notas de esta semana. Entonces, vayan a terminarme lo que me deben, ¿verdad? Si me deben alguna lección, porque estuve viendo algunos sin penitas por ahí, que solo 20% llevaban de, de todo, ¿verdad? Entonces... En clase bien bonito, ¿verdad? Pero ahí no me lo han hecho. Entonces, no, vayan y echen el hombro ahí. ¿Por qué razón? Sería una verdadera pena que bien bonito me trabajen en la clase y que no les dé el 80%, ¿verdad? Eso sería una pena. ¿sí? Tendrían que estar de nuevo conmigo en primero. Entonces, es una, una tortura. <risa> No se torturen así, ¿verdad? Okay. So, Una eh, pregunta. Dígame. ¿Verdad que para estar al día con las tareas es hasta la número 15, verdad? Sí, porque hoy es la 15. Sí. Ah, vale. La, la de hoy es la 15. Ok, exacto. Bueno, los dejo para que descansen. Bye, my dear ones. Sleep well. Take care. Good night. Have a nice weekend. Good night. Good night. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye. Good night. Okay. Take care, my friends. Rest. Be good. Okay. Okay, this one transform into yes, no questions. Only add do and the question mark. Do you have a meeting at 9 a.m.? Number two, does the shop close at midnight? Number three, does Jane usually go home at lunchtime? Four, in England, does it, does it snow in December? Number five, does he plan to travel in the future? Number six, do we have a lot of problems in this century? Seven, does she work on Mondays? Eight, is her birthday on November the 20th? Do you have to work on New Year's Eve? On, or on New Year's Day, or also, don't you have to work on New Year's Day? Okay, number 10, don't you go out on weekends or on weekdays? Or do you go out on weekdays? Number 11, does he usually travel in December? 
12. Does she go to the beach in the summer? 13. Do you normally go to bed at midnight? Yes, I do. Make information questions. What time does Jack take a shower? Where does Betty live? What do Jack and Bill play on weekends? What do Cecilia and Vilma eat for dinner on Saturdays? How often do you go out? Six. Where does Jack go every Sunday? Number seven. What do they do on Saturday night? Number eight. What do they play? No, sorry, on Sundays. Uh, how often do they play soccer? Or when do they play soccer? Nine. What does Betty do every night? What does Betty do every night? Number 10. Why does Jack work? Number 11. Why does Betty study very hard? Number 12. How often does she study the lesson? Number 13. How long do they play video games on Sundays? The last one, make information questions with when or what time, exact hour, what time, when, general time, to make the difference, but when is for everything. What time is exact time? So, when do you usually relax? When does she watch TV? When do you have lunch? What time don't you go out in the evening? Or what time do you go out in the evening? But this is not, so don't you go out in the evening. Five. When, when, does Mark visit relatives? When does she get up late? What time do we exercise in the morning? Eight. What time don't stores open on Saturday? Number nine. When does Mary usually eat cake. What time do you always get up? 11. When does it need rain? 12. When does he celebrate his wedding anniversary? Okay. Good. That's it, okay? What are they talking about? About the immortality of the crab. What time is it? It's 1.08. What time does the meeting start? It starts at 11 o'clock. What time do you arrive at work? At about 6.48 a.m. What time do employees leave? usually around 7 or 8 or 7.30 p.m. There's a recruitment of new employees on Tuesday. Really? What time does it start? It starts at 9 a.m. Let's, let's meet for the meeting on Wednesday. Meet for the meeting, okay. Let's meet for the meeting on Wednesday. Great. 
when do you arrive? I arrive at 8.15 a.m. Or what time do you arrive? I arrive at 8.15 a.m. Tomorrow, I have to go to the photocopy center. Me too. What time does the photocopy center open? It opens at 6.50 a.m. Wendy, do you want to have dinner with me after the workshop? Yes, but what time do restaurants close here? Oh, around 7.25 p.m. Amanda has to take some reports to, my, to many departments on Monday. And uh, what time do they open? They open around 7.30 or 8.05. Okay, that's it, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you, thank you very much.